What's up guys, it's Nick here, and welcome back to another episode of Super Paper Mario. In the last episode, we kind of started uh, walking up this tree, um, we also got a new pixel called Thudley, and we also beat uh, this giant blooper boss. Um, now, if you also remember in the last episode, I kind of got stuck on the tree, um, we're climbing up to the top here, but um, I couldn't fi get, figure out how to get past this part, and apparently... Uh, when you're as slim, I'm not gonna do it now, but I'll do it on the way back. Um, but as slim, all right, well that messed me up. Uh, I guess I need a boomer. Um, but as slim, you can actually move through walls, which I didn't know. Um, when you're um, on a moving platform, so yeah, we're using slim again. Which yeah, I don't actually recall doing so but yeah apparently that's another ability that slim has is going through walls while on moving platform so anyway with that um we're able to make a little pink platform there or red platform don't really know what color it is because i'm a bit colorblind and uh yeah with that we'll probably be able to Jump up here with like a little staircase, kind of. Yeah, there we go. Okay, and then... I guess I need to hit this with Dudley. There we go. Alright, that heals me. Good. I'm gonna hit that button. And... Oh, that almost got... That guy almost hit me. I wonder if you can, can you actually get damaged during like a cutscene? I kind of wonder. Anyway, we probably could have done that, um, that whole section right there in the last episode. Then I could have saved over here and saved me some time because I actually had to do a little bit of things uh, off screen. I mean, it wasn't that bad, it was like four or five minutes. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and save and enter through to the next area. Ahaha, finally you arrive. You don't wear tar tardiness? How can you wear tardiness? You don't wear tardiness well. At last, the hero, I know you from the festival of hair that dances upon your lip. I am a humble servant of Count Black. Master of Dimensions, Pleasure of Crowds, I am Dementio. It is truly enchanting to finally meet my hapless victims. I've prepared a special morsel for a treat for you. Okay, we got a little battle arena here. How about some magic? I think there's actually a stage in, uh, I think I actually played this like in one of my mod Smash Bros. Uh, hacks that I played. I think it actually was. And voila, voila, you are now in Dimension D, a dimension of my own creation. In this mind-bending realm, my attacks are 256 times more potent. Don't know where you came up with that number, but okay. I am now far more powerful. I can obliterate you with a raise of an eyebrow. Now you must duel like two gleaming banjos on a moonlit stoop. Okay, so here we are fighting Dementio. Um, he's just flinging these things at us. Can you pierce this illusion? Oh uh, yeah, I can. Oh wait, never mind, I can't. <laughs> um, can I stump on him? No, I can't. Okay, wait, maybe that's the fake one. So that one's a fake one. The real one is that one. Am I even able to attack her or no? Him? Her? I don't really know. Oh, I can. Okay. Did three damage there. Another three damage. Another three damage. And another three damage. Okay. Yeah, keep being on my level. Aw, oh, man. That messed me up. Oh, I got hit there. Alright, um, that's the real one. So the real one shoots out four. Fake one shoots out two. Or no, three. But that's only one, there's two of them. 
So right now, there's one of them is going to shoot one at a time. Maybe I should go with Bowser to do double damage. But he's going to be a lot slower, though, too. Oh, wait, what does this do? Oh, making platforms. Oh, okay. Good thing I wasn't trapped in those. Alright. Ah, uh, oh, man, I was going to attack her. Or him. I still don't know. Alright, so the real one is over here. Got him. Got him. Ah, oh, I got hit, though. It's fine. It's fine. Ah, oh, man. There we go. Nice. Alright, we killed her. Him? I don't know. Um, I still know the gender of this Dementio guy, girl. Don't know. Your blows are like miniature jackhammers wielded by tiny, angry road workers. How is this possible? This dimension makes me 256 times more powerful. What? You say that this place also makes you more powerful? Ahaha. Uh -huh. Of course, this was simply an amusement that played out exactly as I planned. Were you amused? That was very, uh, horsey deriva. I don't know what that word is. Okay. <laughs> Next time we meet, you will feast on a deadly eight course meal. Ciao for now, my mustachioed foe. I wonder. <laughs> okay. Just have more of thinking. Hmm, a little more, perhaps. They are strong, but they must be stronger yet to defeat Black. I must make sure they can face him with when the time comes around at last. I guess, okay. Wait, was he talking to us? The TV? Okay. Breaking the fourth wall there. Seeing if we were powerful enough to, uh... Telling us if we were powerful enough to defeat Count Black, I see you. Um, wait, what the? Oh, okay, I guess I didn't kill. There we go, now I killed. Um, but yeah, Dementia actually kind of reminds me of, like, now that I think about it, like, Alvis or something like that from, like, Xenoblade Chronicles. He was, like, so mysterious and, like, such a out there character, and when you, like, he's, like, a lot different than the other henchmen of, um, What's his name? Oh my god. Uh. Count Black. Really? Oh my god. This is stupid. I can't even get up on that ledge. Alright. I can't even stomp on him. Why? I'm gonna have to heal myself. Wow, we barely have anything. I'm gonna have to do a stream shake, I guess. There we go, finally you're dead. I don't know what, uh, another one, really? God damn. Akatu's really annoying in this game. Especially because he can't ride his cloud either. On this game. Oh, nice, we got Thunder Rage. That's at least somewhat good. Some we got out of it. Almost we'll spell there. Um, I'm guessing I'm supposed to hit that block that's over there. Okay, maybe not. Uh, so at the top of the tree. Wait, what? All right, one of them is red. I have the oh, two of them are red. Wait, let me point. Point. Oh, right. Oh, oh okay. Um, that works too. I was pointing my Wii Remote at the screen trying to um, use Tippy's power, but I forgot Tippy was kidnapped, so yeah. But um, that worked too, just standing there doing nothing. Help me figure out the puzzle. <sighs> okay. Um, oh, nice. We're actually done with the section, but I'm going to go ahead and take all these coins here. There we go. And done. End of chapter, more like section, but no, it says end of chapter. Do you want to save? Yeah, sure. Save complete. 
Mario, Peach, and Bowser had scaled the tree and defeated Dementio. The exhausted heroes were relieved and to finally see the ivor ivory towers of Fort Francis. Was Tippy safe? Was the next pure heart really waiting for them ahead? Their only answers were the strange voices carried on the wind from inside the fort. Alright, so now we got chapter 3-4, The Battle of Fort Francis. So this is where the that dweeb Fra Francis lives. Puh, what's this castle got over mine? You think Tippy's alright? I'm starting to worry. her. <laughs> this is so high technical. It's a totally undiscovered digital digi digi butterfly species. Nur, I must document it. Mario. Yes, shake that thorax. The digi butter dot nur form guys will be so jealous when I post these shots online. Alright, well, um, okay, Bowser. Here's something that Fort Francis has over Bowser's castle. A uh, locked door. I don't remember the last time that... <laughs> to be honest, I don't remember the last time Bowser's castle had a lock on it. No entry unless you are a super genius like me. Or a totally hot babe. Stay out. Okay, so can we enter as Peach? Will that actually work? Or no. Okay, I guess not. Um, so yeah, I saw there was a pipe over here. Let's go ahead and do it. Alright, so now we gotta use throw you. And of course I miss. There we go. And we got the key. It's basically like under the mat type of key. <laughs> like, oh yeah, your key to your door, to your giant castle is right underground. And the pipe's right there. Alright, looks like he's got he's got some maids here. Oh, I thought they were enemies, okay. Welcome home, master. Well, I'm not really your master, but okay. I'll roll with it. <laughs> Welcome home, master. Today is the street date for Prance of the Unicorns, volume 15, do not forget. Welcome home, master. A baseball game is extra innings has delayed the start of Starship x Knots. I adjusted the record meow, record a meow, start time by 30 minutes to compensate. Welcome home, master. I finished removing commercial breaks from your recorded programs. Welcome home, master. The new space combat sim, Starship x Knot Space Bloops, have arrived, has arrived by mail. Alright, and I think, yeah, the x are a reference to Thousand Year Joy, because those are the bad guys. Alright, so you can see it's a keyhole there. So that's Tippy, and then my remote's acting up really badly, like usual. And there's Francis. Sweet! The resolution on these images is just breathtaking. Nerf. Okay, so I guess we need two keys to enter there. Welcome home, Master. I have finished removing commercial breaks. Yeah, okay. I read these all. Um. Yeah, these are... These would be pretty cool maids to have. Just, like... Kind of do everything for you, you know? I have cataloged all of Master's comics and filed them away. Do not think I did it out of the kindness of my robo heart. 
They were beginning to clog vital fire escape routes from the castle. <sighs> okay. Um, anything here? Yeah, there is. Okay. But yeah, like, how does Fort, how does Francis, like, afford all this? Like, what is he doing for his job that he's able to buy this giant castle and all these robots? Unless he made them himself and he's, like, a actual genius then there's actually like like how else is he able to um afford all this you know but yeah those little uh, made things actually kind of remind me like these guys that's not the evil ones but like the other ones they kind of remind me of uh what's it called the new uh, Google thing. I was I remember like hearing it from like Etika. It was like some box of like an anime girl, and she like tells you like, oh, you're wake up and like you're gonna be late for work, and like these are the train schedules, and like she's like in like the little box and stuff. But yeah, it's kind of weird. Uh, quiet in the hallway. Stomping the stairs, master snap time. Well, good thing we stomped really loud. <laughs> Uh, okay, we can't go there yet. I know what we need for that, but we don't have that yet, so it's probably the other door that we have to go in first. It's kind of weird because it's really not in order. I, mean, I guess from left to right it is, but we're going right from to left. Alright, so we go over here. Uh, can we make it jump? No, okay, we need to be Peach. Wait, what? I can't even make the jump here. What the? Okay, how come I was ma Okay, there we go. I was able to make the jump before, so obviously I can make it now. Alright, so now we switch back to Mario. Make this 3D. Climb up these stairs. And there we go. Alright, we have a button up there, but we can't press it. You, you actually get a little bit of height when you do the ground pound, but not much. Oh, okay, we have to wait for this. Dang it, I missed. Oh, I could have ground pounded there, but I jumped off. Oh, man. Okay. Just gotta wait for the next one. It's fine. <sighs> Just teabag a little bit. <laughs> Alright. If only my Wii Remote actually work correctly, maybe I would actually do a better job. Yeah, this isn't working. Oh, come on. Come on, really? I, like, grazed the side of it. Now we gotta wait for the next one. Okay, here we go. Oh my god, this is so stupid. Why can't I do this? Can I actually... I'm about to die anyway. Uh, okay, I do have power stake, that's good. Okay, and then if I do die, 5 HP. Revive, I guess. <sighs> okay. Just wait some more. Really annoying. Alright, let's wait for it. Come on, there we go. Thank you. Took me long enough. Now we gotta wait for this. 
all of these pixels to load. I feel like in that time that those pixels loaded, you could have loaded like any 2D game. Actually, I take that back. There's some 2D games that take a long time to load. Like, weirdly, Celeste takes a long time to load. I don't know why. But it does. Uh, Wii Remote, stop backing up. Thank you. You have reached the door to Master's private room. For security purposes, you must confirm your identity. Answer the following security questions with either true or false. Video game soundtracks are totally high technical. True. Episode 127 of The Grotus Chronicles is pretty much the, su the sweetest thing ever. True. One day I will own all of the Starship x Not Series 3 collectible action figures. True. Now you must enter passcode. Um, no one told me about this. Meow, 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 meow. You are not the master. Deploy security measures. Wow, okay, you're just gonna drop me like that. This is gonna be another game theory of uh, Mario Zed at this point. <laughs> uh, what does this do? Oh, I probably need to be Bowser to weigh this down. Alright, are you telling me that Bowser and Mario are the same weight? And so that button goes down the same that that's not true. <sighs> Alright, let's just take out this chain chomp. Actually no, we need Thudley, right? No, no, we can do Boomer. So I guess we have to take that, um, yeah, this thing, and place it on the block, or the button. Yeah, I don't, I still don't understand. Like, I thought I was supposed to change Bowser, but apparently not. Apparently it's, you have to bring a block. A block is more heavier than Bowser or Mario. Or just Bowser, I guess. So, like, having a block with Mario weighs more than just Bowser. That doesn't make any sense. <sighs> Alright, anyway. Probably have to go 3D here. Let's go up this pipe. I think I actually remember this. I think I remember either getting lost or something else like that for this. Um... Anyway, I think I'm gonna go ahead and save. So we actually can enter this anytime, I guess, now. I know, I know where we are. We're at the entrance here. Right? This says, hello, master. Okay, yeah, it does. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and save and um, end the episode here. So, um, yeah, thank you guys all for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, stay tuned for more Super Paper Mario right here on Town Deck. Bye.